Hello everybody, it's Techno here. Today I'm going to show you how to find Electrode in Pokemon Emerald version. You can start off by flying over to Lily Cove City. There's two methods of getting this Pokemon. The first is definitely way easier, but it's limited. So from the Pokemon Center in Lily Cove City, you're going to make your way over to the right, hop over these ledges, and go ahead and surf over to the right. You're going to need access to the Team Aqua headquarters over here. Uh, if you don't have access to that, then you just got to proceed in the story a little bit more. And once you can come inside here, go ahead and surf directly upward and make your way to the door in the upper right hand corner. Now, once you're in this door, you're going to take the warp panel on the left. And once you take that panel, you want to go to the warp panel that's all the way at the bottom left over there. So you want to go around this desk and table and whatnot. And in this next room, it's a little confusing, so make sure you pay attention here. It's not super bad, but... Uh, in this first warp, pa warp panel, you want to go ahead and choose the one on the left, then you want to choose the middle one, which you don't have any other option, then you want to choose the left one, then you're going to want to choose the left one again, so go around the middle one. This will take you to uh, the uh, office, the base office here, and there are four items on the ground here, two of which are electrode. The bottom right one, and if you somehow manage to not catch or KO this Pokemon, I just recommend saving if they're here, that'll make it easier for you. You have a second chance by choosing the electrode on the top right. Now, if you miss that one, if you KO it or it explodes or uh, you run out of Pokeballs or something, whatever, you can still catch electrode in the wild, but it's way harder. So literally save if you have those there. That way you can just save yourself the trouble. You can go ahead and fly on over to Mauville City. Uh, and what you're going to need is what's called the basement key. Uh, you're also going to need a Pokemon who can use Surf outside of battle, so make sure you have that. Once you have five badges, which is Surfing outside of battle, you can see Watson here in the center of the city. If you have five badges and he is not here in the center of the city, don't worry about it. That means you've already gotten the basement key, you're already good to go. But he's going to give you the basement key if this is your first time speaking to him here in the center of Mob Hill. And then you can make your way down into Route 110 and go ahead and surf in the water under the cycling road, the seaside cycling road. Go ahead and surf over here and to the right, you can go under the bridge. You'll find a small cave of a place called New Mob Hill. Once you're inside New Mob Hill, go ahead and open up the door with the basement key that Watson just gave us. And now you're in the basement of New Mob Hill. And in this room, you have a very, 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 very tiny 1% chance of finding Electrode here. It's not easy. In fact, it took me like three or four hours thanks to the help and blessing of my uh, little buddy, Pixel. I was able to find this Electrode uh, conveniently right when he said it would spawn. So I don't know if he has magical powers or something, but he made it happen. So that's how you find Electrode in Pokemon Emerald version. And of course, if you're interested in more free of fluff video guides like this one, go ahead and click the playlist that's on screen now. I hope you enjoyed and Techno's out.